Hey y'all, Phyllis here, southernfrugal.com. I wanted to do a real quick little video because so many people have asked, um, sending me emails to do with this uh, new little uh, flat leaf antenna that we got for the new TV and the RV. Now, it works, y'all. I don't know what else to say. It absolutely works. We get, uh, I think Mr. Buggy said, 13 channels. And uh, two of them are sports, which really uh, pleased Mr. Bucky. But anyway, here's what it looks like. I'll just, I don't even have the TV on now, but uh, y'all maybe have, have uh, seen the TV on in my last video. This is what it looks like. I'm guessing it's about the size of a notebook paper. That's what my guess is, maybe a little smaller. It's got two little holes in the top, and it comes with two little pins. So at one point, in fact, there are the... Let me see if I can get it on the camera. Yeah. There are the pins right there. Can y'all... Well, let me see if I can get up here a little quicker and show you. comes with these two little pins, and they're just... T90 little pins is all they are, and at one point we had it up here uh, pinned, but then we realized when we cut it on and uh, set it down on the uh, little dashboard here, it actually picked up as good as it did when it was hanging up. So it will actually pick up for uh, 50 miles, and so if you've got a station within 50 miles, now we've got three stations within 50 miles. Anyway, so you've got the cord, and I'm not going to plug it up because since we're in the RV now, but uh, we've got a little plug-in down here, and we plug the TV in one, so there's the TV connection, and uh, then we plug in the antenna. And here it is, right here, in, an, in the other little plug-in down there. And it's got, I think that's an amplifier that's in with the plug here. Anyway, that's really all there is to it. And uh, again, with us, we're just laying it flat on the dash, and it actually picks up as good as it does hanging up. In fact, you can't tell a bit of difference, so it works. Anyway, so what I wanted to say is I did look it up because so many people had sent me emails and a couple of people uh, left uh, comments uh, on the last video. And so I wanted to answer that by telling you that you can get this exact model, and I'm going to tell you the model number. I'll also put it down in the description below. It is a Mohi or M-O-H-U is the brand name. And it's called a Leaf uh, 50 HD TV antenna. Now, we can pick up 13 stations. In your area, I don't know how many you would be able to pick up. But if you're close to a big metropolitan area, you should be able to pick up at least that many, maybe more than we can pick up. But anyway, we got it at Camping World. Now, we didn't know one thing about it when we bought ours. Not one thing. So we just trusted the uh, salesman or the guy that was helping us to uh, tell us which one. No, did I say Camping World? No, I'm wrong. Forget that. It wasn't Camping World. It was Best Buy. Excuse me. Let me look at this receipt and make sure. Yeah, it was Best Buy. Sorry. It's Best Buy. And uh, the salesman there, and he just went straight to, the, we asked him uh, for an antenna that would work in our RV. He didn't even say a word. He went straight over to the display, picked up that one. He said, this is the best one you can get for inside your RV. And he was absolutely right. It works fantastic. You don't have to turn it or, you know, be holding it up this way or that way. But I was even thinking if we put it out the window, we might be able to pick up something from much further away. I don't know. But anyway, we're very satisfied with it. So it's... Uh, uh, not from Camping World, but from Best Buy, and it's model number MH110584. And at uh, Best Buy, it's $69.99, might be on sale or something now, I don't know. 
But anyway, it's a Mohi, M-O-H-U, Leaf 50 HD TV antenna. Now, you can get some that are much cheaper than this one, but the, the salesman at Best Buy took us to this one for a reason. So uh, anyway, you can also uh, get this through Walmart. Now, at Walmart... They originally were selling it for $89. Now they've got it on sale for $62.50. And I, I don't think they're going to have it in the store. I think you're going to have to order it through the website, but it's free shipping. So it's definitely cheaper buying it through Walmart, or you could go to Best Buy and pick it up without having to order it. So, you know, there's a little bit, uh, cost is a little bit more at Best Buy. But I, they carry it in stock. They had a whole big display, tons of them there. So I'm guessing most camping, I'm, I'm going to say camping world, most Best Buy stores are going to have it in stock. So I don't know anything further about it. I don't know how to compare it with any other antenna because we've never used another one. But I can tell you that we are considering getting one of these for the uh, TV inside. Uh, now, we, we haven't done that yet because we think we might need to keep our cable so that we can get Time Warner in all these different places through Wi-Fi without having to get a Verizon. Uh, I mean, we're with Verizon anyway, but only for our little cell phones that really don't do anything. They're not like smartphones, y'all. They're just, you know, we don't really use them hardly ever. So uh, I couldn't see paying Verizon that huge amount. So anyway, if we have to keep the Time Warner cable in the house in there, uh, to qualify to be able to pick up Wi-Fi from Time Warner anywhere going around, then uh, we'll just we'll just keep it. But uh, anyway, to make my point, so many people I got tons of emails, and I, I didn't get but a couple of comments about it under the video, but I got a lot of emails, people asking me about it and exactly how it worked. So. All you do, and, and let me just show you this now. I'm not an electronics person, but this just plugs in to the back side of the TV, this little part. And then I think this is, a, I don't know, we got the smallest, shortest cord we could get. And now, I don't think you're going to have to worry about picking it up, moving it all around the house to make sure you've got a good signal. I think if you're within 50 miles of the stations that you're trying to get, I think it's going to work, whether you lay it down, stand it up, or whatever. And I think the only thing that might interfere with it uh, would be uh, maybe some kind of metal something, like you wouldn't want to put it on your refrigerator, for instance. I think it would uh, work fine about anywhere, but again, we only know how it works for us, and it works fantastic, I can tell you. Uh, there are cheaper models. I noticed that, some for $39 and some even less than that. Now, we don't know anything about those. All we know is the one where, that we paid $69.99 for absolutely works. And uh, you could probably rid yourself of cable for ever unless you had something special on cable some kind of special channel you wanted to watch and we certainly don't so and anyway a, a lot of those channels like series and everything uh, you can get them on YouTube now we've also got the uh, connection uh, for the computer so it's Mr. Bucky's already got that attached to the back but you just plug this in uh, to the computer on YouTube and it will uh, play of course on the TV and uh, we had one of these cords before and we had to listen uh, to the audio through the computer which I didn't like at all and neither did Mr. Bucky so getting this little cord and I can't remember how much that was it was mm, I don't know maybe ten dollars and we can get the sound through the TV now so that works out so any series that you would be wanting to watch, you could pull them, I mean, you wouldn't be able to watch them the night they came on, but uh, you could uh, pull them up on YouTube and just attach the, get you one of these little uh, cords and attach it to your TV and watch a series a day late. Yeah, because usually it's 24 hours, I think, before they appear on YouTube, but you can definitely do that. So anyway, this is a good way to save money, y'all. Unless there's some special channel 
on cable that you just have to have, then this would, would work for you. Now, we are not real big TV people, but we, uh, Mr. Bucky has his sports that uh, no matter what he has to watch, no matter what. So, and I don't really have anything that I have to watch, but I do have some uh, series I like, like Gold Rush. I really love watching that on Friday night. It kind of says, this is the end of the week, Gold Rush is on, you watch it for an hour, that's it. And I can't think of anything else. I do, of course, like to watch the news. But uh, other than that, I mean, everything's on YouTube now, y'all. Everything. So, you know, movies, whatever you want to watch is on YouTube now. So uh, I don't really see any point in having the cable anymore other than with Time Warner being able to, to have access to all their hot spots. And they've got tons of them all on the East Coast mostly and some on the West Coast, but mostly the East Coast. So... Anyway, I hope that sort of answers your question. So we will see y'all next time. Bye for now.